Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. Two of the best teams in the game square off. The Atlanta Braves taking on the San Francisco Giants. First pitch coming your way next. So now to the plate for Atlanta, Gerald Raymond. Batting third. And every at bat's a big one for him Gerald now as he looks to keep Raymond. this amazing hitting streak going. And first offering is fouled off. <laughs> On the ground. Gathers oh. and throws to first. That's the third out. In order, go to break. And next for Atlanta, Gerald Raymond. Now Sing, you talk about a guy that has all the skills. The range is really good, but the arm just stands out, and he makes all the plays. And the first offering is not close. And because of that big power arm, he's able to play a little bit deeper, make throws from the outfield grass all the way across the diamond, and still get a pretty good runner. That's impressive. Left field, Foster settles under it. Makes the catch inning over. At the play, Gerald Raymond. There's a buzz in the oh, stadium point. every time he comes to the plate as he tries Gerald. to extend his hitting streak. Raymond. And a foul ball. Nobody out, runner at first. Lead runner to second, so two on and nobody out. And that'll keep his now hitting streak alive. He's reaching Rodrigo. heights that very few Rodrigo. players ever have. Yeah, when you're over the 30 game mark and showing no signs of slowing down, that's when the baseball world starts to get a little excited. And this has right become the story in the league right now. You start checking off the days until the next benchmark, 40, 44. Oh, oh this one high and deep, way back there. And it's into the bleachers, out of here. He sends a rocket to left, and they add to their lead. It's 7 3. A good hitter gets pitch recognition early. He saw exactly where that was going to be. The challenge, not get over anxious and come out of your swing. He stayed on it. Now the third baseman, Casey Martin. Now batting. It's interesting. The he plays baseman. kind of a, a power Casey. spot defensively, but Martin. runs pretty well. So when you're looking hey, at that two. position, you're not expecting two. someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. That one down the line, and that squirts through. Throw in, holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. Good job of just putting the ball in play with two strikes. He kind of rolled over on this pitch a little bit, but he got enough behind it to shoot it through for a knock, and you'll take that any time you can get him to find a hole. Could be a chance here for them to start clawing back into this ballgame. All set for the start of the inning, and now the big-time power threat, Gerald Raymond. Whitley back to work. That one is absolutely belted. That's bad. Pulls it in on the warning track. Every day during batting practice, now these batting. outfielders like get about 10 minutes Rubio. of balls in the Now in for the Braves, Gerald Raymond. Now batting. He's not going to get the cheated up there. Ball. No, he's not. Gerald. He's looking to do damage with Raymond. every swing he takes. And a seed into center. That's a base hit. Ramos to third. Not in time. He's safe. You got to get on your horse and get to that thing and get it back in because he's going to come barrel around first. He's going to put pressure on you. If you bobble it or you don't get there in a hurry, he's going to make you look silly and end up on second base. Second and third, one gone. Julio Rodriguez. Next up for the Braves. 
That's towards center. Ramos makes his way towards it. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. Both runners tagging from second and third. Just ahead of the throw, he scores. And it's now a six-run lead. The center fielder, Michael Harris. So now to the plate for Atlanta, Michael Harris. And this is a big opportunity for him to pick up his teammate right here. Yes, he didn't drive it here. And here it comes. Lifted in the air, right center field. Myers moving under this one. Squeezes it. And that is that. 8 9 1 due up in the bottom of inning number nine. Braves nine and the Giants three. Well, with this sixth win in a row, all of a sudden, you start to look around, up and down the lineup, to your left, to your right as a player, and you say, you know what, we're good. Uh, we may have had some tough times earlier on, but this is a good team, and you start to expect this kind of play out of yourselves. We'll see if this translates into a longer winning streak than it is right now. 9-3, your final.